So this is a quick tutorial for creating an undisclosed recipients list in Google Contacts. So the first thing you'll need to do is go ahead and log into your account and go to Contacts. And once you're in Contacts, the first thing you'll need to do is create a new group. And towards the left side of the page, there's actually a new group icon or a new group tag. And so I'm just going to call this test group. So here's the group. So you wanted to come up with some name that's going to mean something to you, though. So maybe like first period class or parents or something like that. So I have my test group. Now that if I click on test group and I go up to the little person icon and I start typing in a name. So I'm going to add jwood at natomascharter.org to the group. So there's one person. And then maybe I'll add um, another teacher to the group. And so those email addresses start populating into the group. Now, unlike other email programs, you don't set this group as an undisclosed recipient group here. What you actually have to do is in mail, when you want to send a message to that group, what you'll do is you'll compose the message. So I'll click on compose here. And in the BCC, you put in test group and it'll start showing up. And then you can actually leave the two line blank, or you can actually um, send it to yourself. So I might just send this to test teacher, since that's the count that I'm working in. And um, I, you know, this is my test email, and I can put a little message. I'm testing to see how this appears, and hit send. So now I'm actually going to minimize this and go into my other account. And here's the email that I got from test teacher. And notice I can see that it came from test teacher, um, but that I was to me, but I was BCC. So that's actually how it will look to um, the people receiving your email. All right, let me know if you have any questions.